Right now, we're going to head back up to ringside with Noah Andrew. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. S introducing first. It was an upset with that and big his opponent. Over Skulls. Oh, yeah, it was Skulls' this match, and Taryn came in and just took him down. But who is going to step up to the plate tonight? Well, not what I expected, but I'll definitely take it. Weighing in tonight, 280 pounds from St. Clair Shores, Michigan, old school Rick. Cartier. Well, hell, I don't know if you heard old school, but he pointed to Jack Taren and said, that's a big dude. And coming from old school Rick Cartier, you know you're a big dude. You're absolutely right. Old school Rick Cartier, one of the great superstars here in the Michigan Wrestling Organization, former tag team champion, former Great Lakes champion. And he is stepping up to the plate here, so to speak, Let me against you. Jack Taren. Absolutely. And old school, of course, one of the most popular performers, competitors, superstars here within the MWO, but frankly, I think when that rose goes up, old school Rick Cartier goes down. This is going to be a tremendous matchup. We did not know who Taryn was going to be facing tonight up until this very moment, so you got to believe that Taryn didn't know as well. No, but I don't think that bothers Jack Taryn in any way, shape, or form. Jack Taren is out here to compete. Jack Jack Taren is out here to destroy. And he didn't care if it was Tyler Dean, old school Rick Cartier, whoever. The big, small, all will fall to Jack Taren at this point, in my opinion. These are two superstars, both with their eyes on the prize, and that is the Michigan Wrestling Organization Heavyweight Championship currently held, as we've seen earlier, during the doghouse. The real deal, Michael Reaver, but right now, Taryn back and Cartier up. Cartier reverses it. Man, oh man, like two big bulls in there. Oh, absolutely. This is two big bull mooses, two big alphas in the ring. They're button heads. And uh, this is not going to be a, a technical finesse show. Old school does is known to get a little technical at times. But with Jack Taron in the ring, you need to focus on the power game, and you need to try and take him out from, from the legs. Axel James Gear is at ringside for Taron, of course. You always got to keep an eye on him. Very mysterious individual in his own right. Absolutely. The shepherd, Axel James Gear. I, uh, oh, I have nice not block. had a chance. A nice, very nice block. Look at Cartier. Oh, oh nice. my goodness. A big short lariat takes down Jack Taron. I'm I'm a little impressed with that. Yeah, no kidding. Oh, One old school, count. Old school took way too long to make the cover. He might have caught Taron there, caught him off guard. Well, it's not very often you see Jack Taron go down from one clothesline, but that is Rick Cartier, ladies and gentlemen. He is he is he is a lot more powerful than people will give him credit for. Oh, absolutely. Cartier has a lot of power and he's got a lot of technical aspect in there. There's a reason they call him old school. Now it's Jack Taron burying them shoulder blocks right in the midsection of Cartier. Referee Dan Tanner right there. Absolutely. And I don't know if you've ever walked by Jack Taron in the locker room or seen him or been near him at all, but those shoulders are the width of a old man's body. You got that right. Nice. Another clothesline takes down Taron. I'll tell you what. Rick uh, Cartier. He's not going to get him over for a vertical, is he? He's trying. Taron blocks it. Guys, again, another block by Taron. Taron shifted him back up into the corner. That's the power. The power advantage and look there. at the smile on Axel James Gear. He's always watching. He's always planning. 
Jack Terran, you said is on a roll, ladies and gentlemen. He has seemingly put put the big kibosh, so to speak, on skulls. Oh, absolutely. And you got to wonder, you know, is the MWO title in his immediate future, or you know, what's what's happening at this point? I, I think at this point, Jack Terran is that's Jack Terran's decision. You're, you're probably oh, right. Oh, man, Ooh, Cartier. Big, big chop from the old Three. school. Ooh, oh, another Lord. one. On, I think oh. if Jack Terran decides oh. that he wants oh. that championship, oh. it's only a matter of time. Big knife edge chops there by Cartier. Box Terran up in the opposite corner. Car Cartier just chopped Jack Terran so hard his own elbow pad came off. Oh, nobody home. Cartier hard in the buckles. Get the right hand. He fires right back. They're going to the nail. Hero slam and slam Absolutely. Neck. This is incredible. The entire ring, the entire building might be shaking. Throwing big hands in the ring. Nice kick from old school. He's looking for that blast from the past. Beautifully executed by Cartier, huh? Oh, but look at the shepherd. Look at the shepherd. Gear is up on the up on the apron, ladies and gentlemen. He's got no business being on the apron. Oh, he has all the business in the world. And Jack, Ter is Jack Terran is already up from the blast from the past neck breaker. Wow. Usually takes at oh, least five minutes. Oh! Headbutt. That's the headbutt that ch caved in the chest One, of skulls. Two. And old oh, school Rick Cartier falls to the Rams horn headbutt. Unbelievable. <laughs> you heard it as much as oh, and Jack Terran is not done. He is sending a message. Jack Terran sending a message to everyone within the MWO that he is, in his own words, the Alpha. Wait a minute, wait that's, a minute. That's Tragedy Ann. Tragedy Ann is here at ringside. Does that mean Skulls is nearby? We have not seen Skulls since Trick or Slam. That is Tragedy Ann, ladies and gentlemen. Is Tra Tragedy Ann is getting in the ring. What is she? Wait a Wait, minute. Wait, who is that? Ladies and gentlemen, that's Ox Convict. The Ox Convict. Ox Convict is here in Lake Orion. He made his own oh, one. Oh no! Ox Convict. A huge double underhook DDT. Ex Convict ascending. Ex Convict, we saw him make his return at Trigger Slam in one of the elimination matches. Rick Cartier just stole Axel J. Beautiful squad time bomb there by S. Convict, and they has come back and made a huge statement against Jack Terran, ladies and gentlemen. Well, 